Good afternoon, Arts Academy community. It's Mr. Ryan, Principal of Arts Middle. Today, we are gonna go into part two of our standards-based grading informational system. We're gonna go over our unit maps. Now, one of the ways schools can make the biggest gains and the most growth is by working together as a team. So our teachers meet in teams all the time, especially, come on, look at planning units. So the first thing they do is, what are the agreed upon standards to be taught over the month. So our teachers really dig into the standards that they're teaching in order to become experts at the standards, in order to make everything clear for the kids. So they prioritize the standards, listen, discuss for the month, and then research and really break down the standards. The next thing we do is what do we want students to learn? We map out the learning to targets and success criteria for the month. So we make sure we have enough time to teach all that we want to teach. So we break down the learning targets, standards to targets, clear descriptions of standards written in ICANN statements. We look at the level of rigor. Are we matching and teaching with the rigor of the standard in mind? So mastery of the standard would be, what does mastery of the learning target look like? The level of thinking must match the challenging level of rigor that's on the standard. Provide an example and or a description. The next thing they do is, what is the simpler learning goal? Which we're calling approaching. And that's the prior knowledge, skills, and or key academic vocabulary needed to master that target. And then we're pushing all kids, what does it take to exceed the standard? So what is the next level of progression beyond mastery? It's a more complex goal. So our teachers will meet and they'll plan this out. Then they'll meet in vertical teams later on the Wednesday of the first of Wednesday of every month and go over this together in order to get that vertical alignment. The next thing we do is every three weeks, we come back and we measure, did we master what we were teaching. So we create what we call a common form and assessment, assessment, collected evidence of learning from the month. Okay? And then lastly, we look at the learning tasks that we're teaching to make sure they all align. So what are the tasks we want to look at? What are the questioning and what evidence we collect every day to make sure our kids are mastering learning targets? Come over here, let me show you exactly what we mean. So here's a reading standard, RI 6.2. Determine the central idea of the text and how it's conveyed through the details. Provide a summary of the text distinct from personal opinions or judgment. We would break this down into multiple learning targets. We would circle the verbs and underline the nouns. So here's determine, and here's provide, and then we would underline the nouns. So determine the central idea of the text, provide a summary of the text, and we would have two learning targets right there. So we would expect kids to be able to do this know what success looks like, and then also self-grade themselves looking at the learning targets for the unit. Thank you. We will now go on to our third unit check. School Messenger, we will be sending you another video installment of our standards-based grade.